So, without further ado, let's uh, throw my other three retaliators here. And let's, uh, let's take this apart, shall we? Besides, I need to throw a 9 kilogram spring in here simply to compete against a friend for the disassembly challenge. Okay. Okay. So, there is our Velasco. And there it is, and of course, it's very dramatic. Okay. First thing you want to do, of course, is remove this. I am very surprised at the fit. I don't feel any jangle on the barrel whatsoever. I don't know why. Okay. Uh, okay, so there's that. There's that. Put in mind, I've put, I've taken the pawn and put together recons and retaliators hundreds of times. Okay, thousands. I'm pretty good at this. So. Let's see here. What is so different about this beast? Can we get to the core of it? Or did they just relabel it that it can do nine feet on? Because I'll tell you right now, it does not feel 90 feet flat. A super below, so that does 90 feet flat. If you want 90 feet flat, get yourself a black tactical or two spring and a couple of orange monoblocks trigger tap springs, and you have got yourself. Uh, you have got yourself uh, 90 feet flat. Okay. The painting on this is sloppy in places. Uh, especially up here with this this uh this it's supposed to look like a like a three way safety from the forty five, it doesn't, but I'm in love with the white. Absolutely hypnotized by the white. I think the white is pretty. I just think that you need like a sticker here or something to cover this up because it's all pretty. And then also the nerf logo, it's not like black or gray or anything anymore, like on this side it is. They didn't do it on this side though. Distance I was shooting there was was up, was was about 45 feet away. That's pretty good for 45. It's definitely shooting over 45 feet. Away. Okay. What is so 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 different about the XD, in particular the XD retaliate attack? While I'm at it, I really want to get rid of a few pieces of junk that I don't like in a retaliator anyway. Uh, we all know what those are. Locks. Our trap door because you may have little kid fingers and you might get them crushed or something stupid, right? Something stupid. Okay, I don't have another one on me, but I'll say this. It's identical to a normal one. Okay? A normal spring that you find in any plastic. Any any retaliator anywhere. It's it's nothing different there. Trigger catch? Is that different? No, not different at all. It's the same as well. And let's see. The, um, the gates 
same. The bolt stays the same. How about those fingers? How about that? Yeah. How about that? What do you think? Hmm. Let's see. Same fingers would have the same figure height on them, right? I that that hmm. Let's see. They do appear to be longer. They are the entire length. They are the entire length of the. Uh, they are the entire length. Uh, of, of the uh, tight area of the barrel. They do appear to be longer. Now, are they actually? I don't know. Let's see. What do I got to compare it to? Huh. Huh. Nothing. How about that? So, it doesn't seem anything special about this cluster. Oh, hum, oh, hum. How does how does our, how does our hey wait how does how does our how, how does our uh, trigger how how does our plunger uh, plunger tube look? Wait a minute, how does it look? Oh, it's the same old plunger tube that is always on. There. Okay. Um, let's see. What's the deal, Neff? What's the deal, Hasbro? I don't understand. This is the same the last time I was buying for these rocks. It is no different. It is no better. It's the same old, same old. It's just repackaged it's XD. So, should you go out and get one of these?